Peace be upon you. In this video, we present a scientific miracle of the Holy Quran, frost damage of plants. The term plant physiology is used to describe the scientific study of the physical, chemical and biological functioning of plants. It is a sub-discipline of botany, which is the scientific study of plants in general. In 1648, the Belgian chemist and physiologist Jean-Baptiste van Helmont, born 1580, died 1644, published the first experiment in plant physiology. In 1727, the English clergyman Stephen Hales, born 1677, died 1761, who is considered the father of plant physiology, published many experiments in his book Vegetable Statics. Nowadays, Plant physiologists demonstrate that frosty wind damages plants and may kill them. Freezing temperatures or cold weather can cause water in the cells of plants to freeze, leading to damage in the cell walls. This kind of damage in the plants is called frost damage and can be easily noticed when the growth of a plant is distorted, and the plant becomes dark or black. Depending on the type of plant, damaging frost can be classified as light frost and hard frost. Light frost occurs at temperatures between minus 2 degrees Celsius and 0 degrees Celsius, while hard frost occurs at temperatures below minus 2 degrees Celsius. Hard frost produces more damage than light frost. When the level of damage in the cell walls is high, plants die. In cold regions, where frost damage may take place, farmers use special arrangements, including plastic sheets to cover and protect their crops. The effect of frosty wind on the plants was mentioned in the Holy Quran more than 1,400 years ago. Chapter 3, verse 117, What they spend in the life of this, material, world may be likened to a wind which brings a nipping frost. It strikes and destroys the harvest of men who have wronged their own souls, it is not Allah that hath wronged them, but they wronged themselves. Thank you for watching this video.